Hello District 1 students, staff, and families. In this week's Where We Stand Wednesday, I would like to begin to explain how COVID-19 is impacting our staff. As of Tuesday, August 31st at 8.30 a.m., 270 staff are out because of COVID-related issues. Some of those staff are sick, others are close contacts or exhibiting symptoms, or even taking care of a sick or excluded child. Staffing, from teachers to bus drivers and beyond, remains a huge issue which we are monitoring hourly. For example, in the Lexington Attendance Zone, we are down more than 50% of our bus drivers, which is causing significant service delays. As our staffing issues grow, it becomes harder and harder to serve children safely and provide them with the world-class education that you demand and that they deserve. Now let's talk a little bit about students. On January 13th, 2021, we experienced our highest active positive cases of last school year at 142 students. Last week, that number was already more than doubled at 305. As of now, 511 students are currently positive. Now, as we look ahead, the alarming news is, is that another 623 students are showing symptoms, which means our positive cases will likely continue to rise. It's very important to remember that some schools are getting hit much harder than others right now. A combination of staff and student absences make daily operation incredibly difficult. Now is the time to prepare for what you will do if your child must quarantine because of close contact, isolate because of sickness, or if your student's school must temporarily shift to e-learning. Get your plan in place now because we are experiencing large amounts of in-school spread which we did not see last year. I cannot stress this enough to students and staff. Please wear your mask while we are in high community spread to help us lower this impact. Finally, today I would like to thank our Lexington District 1 staff for going above and beyond. We have nurses who are working night and day trying to contact Trace and notify families. Bus drivers doing double and triple routes. Teachers supporting students both in class and virtually. School counselors, principals, executive secretaries, and many others filling in as substitute teachers. Human resource employees working through the weekend to handle personnel issues. We are doing all of this so we can keep school going. We are doing this for you and your child, and we're happy to do it. But we need you to do your part too. And that means masking up for now, talk to your doctor about vaccination if you're eligible, and stay home when you're sick. Thank you for watching Where We Stand Wednesday and for your continued patience and support as we move onward as one.